up and jump down and start head banging. This is the show that won't leave you hanging. Let's face it, amazing is pure bliss. It's the show that's bigger than a sumo's hips. Now here's the major of the maze, the four o'clock fiend, the joint chester and the three-point shitter, Mr. James Sherry! <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> you know what? I rehearsed that about a hundred times before you guys joined us, and I didn't get one in. And as soon as you got here, bang, ball straight through the hole, three points! Oh, I'm really quite pleased with that, and I'm quite pleased that these people are with us. Hi, my name is Cara Rashford. I enjoy netball and modelling. My favourite teacher is Mr. Denner. Hi, I'm Mira Swanson and I enjoy hockey and music. My favourite teacher is Mr. Dana. How are you both? Good. Excellent to have you along. Lee, you're, uh, you're, Kiss is your favourite band. Yep. Yeah, what do you like about Kiss? Um, theatrics and just how they sing. And the makeup? Yeah. Yeah, what's your favourite song? Um, Juice. Juice, right. So last year when um, they were here for the concerts, did you go? No. Why not? Because um, of the cost. What, how much was it? $60. $60. Do you think concerts are like overpriced, too expensive? Mm, some of them. Some of them? Like Michael Jackson, for example, $120, you know? Like, is that a reasonable price to ask for Michael Jackson? Not really. Why not? Because it's really expensive. It's, it's too much, isn't it? Yeah. Far too much. How much would you would you expect pay for a band, to go and see a band in concert? $60 to $70. $60 to $70 max sort of thing. Yeah. You're into the Phantom too. Yep. You got a couple of rings. What? That, I didn't realise there were actually two different rings. What are they? Um, the Good Sign, which is Jungle Patrol, and the Death's Head. Right, and you've got them both. Yep. Yeah. Are they valuable? Not really. No, but good to have because you're into the Phantom. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Cara, how are you? Good. You're into the Phantom? No. No. Uh, you into Kiss? No. What are you into? Um, modelling and network. You do some modelling? Yeah. Yeah, what sort of modelling? Um, you just like parading on catwalk, catwalk and stuff, <laughs> yeah. Photographic work? Yep. Yeah? And uh, Dennis Rodman you'd like to meet? Yeah. Why, because of the zany hairstyles he has or? Yeah, I just like how he plays basketball. Right. And I've always wanted to meet him. Do you like his acting ability? Yeah. Yeah? What movies have you seen? Um, I haven't seen any, but I'm going to see one. So you like his acting ability even though you've never seen him acting? Yeah, but I've seen like the previews. Oh, okay. So the previews make him look good. Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> Good luck to both of you today. Uh, welcome to the show. You're playing for Cardinia, your school, who are trailing a little bit at the moment because these guys are in front. Hi, my name's Megan Hyde. I enjoy dancing and playing the clarinet. My favourite teacher is Mr Glass. Hi, I'm Amy Hawk. I enjoy reading and playing the clarinet. My favourite teacher is Mr Adichie. Oh, Mr Amy, good to have you along. You'd like to meet the Olsen twins, yeah. who are... Now, tell me their first names, because I could never figure it out. Mary-Kate and Ashley. Mary-Kate and Ashley are the two girls. Mary-Kate's yeah. one, Ashley's the other. Yeah. They're from... Full House. You like that show? Yeah. Have you seen their movies? Um, I've seen It Takes Two. Do you know the song for that? Uh, sort of. <laughs> you, can you sing it? <laughs> no. No, because you're not a singer, are you? No. no during the music, you play the clarinet. Yes. Tell us about that. Um, well, this is the second year I've been doing it. And, yeah. Yeah? You want to join a symphony orchestra when you're older? Yeah? Why? Um, because I think it would be cool to play with them. Yeah? Is there a symphony orchestra that is the world's best? Um, I'm not quite sure. You're not sure? No. no but that's the one you want to be with, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Your best friend is? Megan. Megan, right there yeah. next to you. What, what does it mean being best friends? What, what do you two do together? <laughs> Everything. Yeah, and speak and giggle and stuff. It couldn't stop giggling before the show, let me tell you. Megan, how are you? You live in a zoo. Yes, I live Tell us, what well, you're an exhibit, are you? No, we're not an exhibit. When you come to visit the zoo, you can't really see our house, but we right. still live. Why is that? Like, do you, your parents are involved, or what's what's the story? Um, we live there because my dad's the director of conservation. Right. Yeah. So he's the boss. Yes. He, he basically of. owns the zoo. <laughs> yes. Yes. Do you get to play with the animals? Um, not really, not much. No. Feed them? Uh, sometimes. Only when like new babies are born or something. Oh, you get to play with the baby animals? Uh, not often, but sometimes. Yeah. Do you get to walk them like? Take the giraffe no. for a walk? No. No, no. Hey, good that you could get out of the zoo today, got out of the cage. Good to have you both here with us. Um, you're playing for South Perth, your school, who are in front at the moment by 200 points even. Have a look at the scoreboard. 702, 502. South Perth with a 200 point lead. So, uh, 
Uh, yesterday, unfortunately, I think for the first time ever on Amazing, no keys coming out of the maze run. So, a bit of bad luck there for Cadinia, but maybe you can turn that around today. Let's uh, get some points on the board right now. We'll stick with Cadinia. You get the first question for the day. Good luck with this. It's a what am I? I'm a thing with eight letters. 90 seconds on the clock. Your time starts now. I'm the title of a person who holds a degree in the arts or sciences. I'm also a type of shelf, self-contained flat with a separate bedroom. I'm the male equivalent of a spinster. I'm the name given to an unmarried man. First letter B, second letter A, th third letter C, fourth letter H, fifth letter E, sixth letter L, seventh letter O, final letter R, B-A-C-H-E-L-O-R. -E Bachelor it is. Down to the keyboard and type it out as quick as you can. A little bit of time getting eaten up there by uh, the clues and having your spell and everything, but we'll uh, get this typed out, get some points on the board. Bachelor, law, L, O, and the last letter, Bachelor, is that one there coming back to base. A tough one. At the beginning of the week, we had some really easy questions. I said to the question writer, make them a bit tougher, and obviously they did. Sorry about that. Uh, here's your points. 53 of them. Good luck with this. 53, the score you want to beat. It's what am I? I'm a thing with eight letters. 90 seconds on the clock. Your time starts now. I'm a plant with a bright yellow bell-shaped flower. I'm the emblem of the Cancer Council and have a special day when I'm sold to raise money. Lesson? I only have one flower at the end of each stalk. I'm grown from Sunflower? a bulb and bloom in spring. First letter D, second Daisy? letter A, third letter F, fourth letter F. Daffodil. Yes, it's the daffodil. The emblem of the Cancer Council. So I'm when... I don't know what the name of the day is, but when that day comes up, buy a daffodil. Daffodil. The D, two letters to go. Daffodil, the I, and the last letter Right there, thank you. You can see fairly even questions to 53 you were looking for. You did improve upon that. 57. A four point lead for South Perth. Stay with us. On Wheel of Fortune, adding a proton to the wheel every night. Who will be the lucky winner of the proton as you test your own skills against the champs? Oh, I'd be able to solve this if I was at home. See, it's a lot easier at home. Wheel of Fortune, 5:30 today on Seven. Payday is a crazy calendar game where you can be at the top of the world one day. I want a sweepstakes. And at the bottom of the barrel the next. I'm flat broke. Aw, oh, pay up. Because every day in payday is another chance to yeah. break the bank. Yeah, right. And mm. just when you think you know who's found their fortune. Yeah. And who's lost oh. their shirt. No. It can all change. No. Right up until. Yes. Payday. Ups, downs and other crazy stuff in between. Introducing new Kellogg's Rice Bubbles treats. The great taste of Kellogg's Rice Bubbles mixed with chewy marshmallow. It's the taste you've just got to have. I want one! But don't forget your friends. Once you've tried Kellogg's Rice Bubbles treats, you've just got to have more. Junior golfers, are you under 18 and would like the chance to play at a golf tournament this school holidays? Then enter the West Australian Channel 7 Junior Golf Classic. It's on Monday the 6th of October at Marangaroo Golf Course. There are events for boys and girls of all ages and great prizes to be won. So start practicing now and look for your entry form in the West Australian or phone Marangaroo Golf Course on 9484-1000 for details. Disney Pictures presents Hercules. Now Hercules and all the stars are yours to keep with McDonald's Hero World Happy Meal. There are six out-of-this-world characters to collect. Plus you get a cheeseburger, fries and coke, all for an earth-shattering $3. Uh-oh, here we go again. Hero World Happy Meal, now playing at McDonald's. So it is maze run time. Daffodil. Amy, you're looking for daffodil? 57 seconds to find those letters. A four-second head start for you. Over to your starting position, please. 53 seconds. 53. So you're going to have to wait four seconds for the green light. But then head into the maze, Lee, and find the letters of bachelor, which you are one now. See? <laughs> okay, over to the starting position, please. 57, 53 on the clock. 
Tick-tock. A four-second head start. Well, if Lee's a bachelor, does that mean Aggie's a daffodil? Oh, I doubt it. Anyway, 45 left on the clock. Southford with a lead today, maintaining their, um, their momentum the whole week. They have not been behind since we started recording on this show this week. So, uh, you know, a round of applause for them, I guess you have to say. 30 seconds left as we head through the doors there, and through the dungeon. Searching for the letters of Daffodil is Amy, and searching for the letters of Bachelor is Lee. I didn't mention companion schools earlier, I can do that quickly now if you like. With uh, Cadinia in green, it's McFarlane Cat from Catherine East in Northern Territory, McFarlane Primary School. And uh, in the yellow, with South Perth, is Sebastopol from Sebastopol in Victoria. Oh, so a lot riding for those schools as well, a lot riding for the schools that we've got here. Will it be Cardinia or will it be South Perth who win this excellent pack from Encyclopedia Britannica comprising 20 volume children's Britannica, the 12 volume fascinating fact series, the beautifully presented 558 page uh, Atlas and the Britannica CD-ROM. Open your mind to a new world of wisdom, Encyclopedia Britannica. We've lost Lee, he's on his way now so we'll count some letters on this side. Hand those to me Amy, or that to me, the word was... Daffodil. Daffodil, there is an A in Daffodil. Ten points there for you. Very nice work. And on this side, just in the nick of time, the word was? Bachelor. Bachelor. There is an A, a B, an R, and an... Oh, no F. No. Uh, so, you got the bar from Bachelor. Look at that. 30 points. 30 points to 83. 67 second round of time zone right now. Chance here to make up a little bit of lost ground. Good luck to you both. It's a what am I? I'm a two-word movie with 13 letters. Two-word movie, 13 letters, 90 seconds on the clock. Your time starts now. Eva Gregory really wants a dog, however, her parents won't let her have one. In the park, Eva finds the perfect pet who is cute and cuddly, and she names him Dodger. Dodger actually belongs to Azro, a gypsy, and has been trained to steal. The biggest crooks in town are trying to get this monkey back. Monkey trouble? Yes, it's monkey trouble! Indeed it is. letter answer so this score very nicely done 47 points well done <laughs> a tough crowd tough crowd we've got in today good luck to you both 40 you have to get better than 47 so the crowd will cheer instantaneously okay good luck it's a what am i a two-word movie with 13 letters two-word movie 13 letters 90 seconds on the clock your time starts now three pets go on a danger and excitement filled journey yeah <laughs> is much better. Very nicely done. South Perth going to have to work very hard in the next maze run. Looking for letters when we come back. Tonight. Your family must be wondering who I am. Or what she is. Did he mention apartment to you? Is it just business? It's more than that. Get ready for the dirt. Plus. How about dinner? It was a brave offer. What? But why the no show? Home and away tonight at seven. See you later, Chef! No! The game's 13 Dead End Drive, where you can get rich by accident. It's nighty night for the hairdressers! Someone will inherit a fortune, but everyone's dying to bump you off. A little trip for the fortune teller! First out of 13 Dead End Drive, while their picture is above the mantle, wins! Lights out for the boyfriend! The fun's alive with 13 Dead End Drive! Working hard or keeping healthy Got a healthy life And I know all the rules Gotta keep it organic if you wanna be cool Gotta have the taste for living Gotta have the taste 
only a soy drink made from organic soybeans could taste this good. That's why millions of people around the world prefer Vitasoy. If you knew what was best for you, you'd drink Vitasoy too. Hey, party with these different new Kellogg's Confetti Fruit Loops, sprinkled with cool confetti colours. Yum, yum, crunchy fun! <laughs> New Kellogg's Confetti Fruit Loops make breakfast even more of a party. Walt Disney Pictures presents Hercules. This kid is the genuine article. Versus Hades, the thunder from down under. Get ready to rumble. Hercules. Whoa, is my hair out? No, I'm not doing it. I'm not. I'm sorry. We can't. We can't do the maze run until Megan does a little bit of ballet for us. Okay? She's been doing it for six years. I oh, hear she's fantastic, and she's refusing right here, point blank, on national television to dance for us. One, just one, plie, one little jump, Megan. Okay. We can't do the maze run until you do. <laughs> we can let Kyra go in for a maze run. Come on, just one, one, one little. <laughs> Kara. Homeward bound, you're looking for. 67 seconds to find those letters. Over to your starting position, please. Okay, Megan, you can go, Maze, running. 47 seconds. Monkey trouble. Over to your start position. 47, 67 on the clock. Go! She's a tough cookie, I tell you. I thought, I thought I could weaken her there, but not to worry. No, she wants to focus on the maze run, so that's fair enough. Cara there with an extra 20 seconds. Kadena picking up the answer to that movie very, very quickly. So an extra 20 seconds, which means South Perth has to find a lot of letters here. So Megan really having to concentrate, really having to work hard in the 47 seconds that she has available. And in fact, only 37 of them left now. South Perth, of course, with the lead for the week. Virginia leading today. So could this be their big comeback that we've all been waiting for? Well, I've got to tell you, that's a McFarland primary school in Catherine in the Northern Territory. Our first Northern Territory school is a companion school, by the way. Very happy to see Virginia doing much better today. And a good fistful of letters there for Cara too. How's Megan going? Couldn't quite see in a hand, but doesn't matter. We'll be able to check it out in less than five, a bit more than five seconds. Because that's how much time we've got left here. Okay, everybody out of the maze and we'll check out the players' price. Jake. All of our players receive a free Super Session past the time zone. This allows you to play any games in time zone free for two hours. Then get verbal with Oz Attack. You won't win friends, but you can win the game. Oz Attack from Good Toy Stores. And to help you stay cool at school this summer, the Day Dawn Water Bottle. It's pretty cool. You also get pets, a unique combination of toy and candy. Candy and toy. Become a pets head and start collecting now. Plus, fill in the free entry form and get a pets t shirt and CD free. Pets, it's available every. Lastly, a Colgate Oral Care Pack with a classic toothbrush and sparkle toothpaste. Oral Care, only from Colgate. <laughs> Football. Oh, no, that's later. Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, over this side, how many of those letters there? Trying to put them in order as much as possible. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Your answer was homeward bound. There is an H, there is an O, there is an E, M, an E, a W, an A, an R, a D. All of homeward bound. You've got the B and the D from bound, no F. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one hundred points. <laughs> Out of a possible 13. Pass me all the letters there. The word was... Monkey, Monkey trouble. trouble. Monkey Trouble. An M, a K, an E. Are uh, there? An L and an E. Yes. No H in Monkey Trouble. So these letters acceptable. One, two, three, four, five. 50 points for you there. Nice work Computer challenge time. Donkey Kong Country 2. This is Pirate Panic. We're looking for bananas. Amy, what you have to do in 75 seconds is get the most bananas. You really want the 50 points here, okay? It'd be a nice way to finish off. So good luck to you. 75 seconds on the clock right now. Looking for bananas, go. Amy is away. Pirate panic it is. Donkey Kong Country 2. And, uh, yes, as I said, the 50 points for South Perth would be uh, very, very nice indeed. The scores at the moment, Padinia 250. Spatful 164. Uh, that's the way to do it. 
Joe, you've got to jump up on those bonus bananas up the top coming down very nicely indeed. Thank you very much. For Amy, knowing a few of the tricks here, able to capitalise on that. And hopefully, and hopefully, it will um, it'll bring the result that they are wishing for. Very nicely played so far. Amy doing very nicely indeed. And Dixie, Dixie and Diddy. And I have a few problems with the crocodile in the barrel here going down. And this is, um, yeah, not really where we want to go, I don't think. Okay, we've got 10 seconds left, Amy. 10 seconds left. Got to try and grab some bananas here in this time. Well, your banana count is 75 seconds. This is quite nice, actually. 64 of them. <laughs> it's that crowd again. They don't like 47 points. They don't like 64 bananas. Lee, I don't know if you're happy or not. It'll all depend on the next 75 seconds, I suppose. 65 bananas will make you at static because it means you get the 50 points. You go to look for keys this afternoon. Maybe those Game Boys going home in your pocket today. Good luck to you, Lee. 75 seconds on the clock. Press the start button now. 65 bananas we are after. How are we going to go? 65 bananas, the countage that will... Oh, dear me. Not the perfect start. Well, not even a good start, you know, by any means. Only two bananas and then, um, you know, running into one of the rats. So, Lee having to carry on. He gets those two bananas again. And this time over the rats, so that's good news. He grabs Dixie Gong there. And now going back for the bonus. Watch out for the rat. He gets the rat. Continuing on now, trying to get up to the bonus. And can he do it? Alley oop and throw and barrel and bang and bananas. Yes, indeed. Very nice. So following in the footsteps. Almost to the letter of Amy. We're down to 30 seconds, Lee. Looking for more bananas. We need to get to 65, 65. Gives you the 50 points. Give you a very nice score. We'll break that magic 300 barrier if we can do that. If not, still a very good score. Let's see. Time ticking down. 10 seconds, Lee. Oh, dear. Getting bitten there, but that's okay. Continuing on. We need more bananas. Where are they? Can we find them? Oh, no. 64 we were looking for, Lee. Your banana count today. 60. So falling four short. Very nicely played. 25 points in the computer challenge. 275. 50 points for Amy. 214. So... Second day in a row, Cadinho, a chance here to turn it around. A chance to turn it around. Yesterday, no keys. Let's see if you can find some. But first, we have to say goodbye to our South Perth players, Amy and Meg. Thank you very best friends. Uh, Megan didn't dance for us, but, you know, that's OK. We can handle that. We'll still give you your players' prize, Megan. 214 points going towards the school total. That'll help maintain that lead that you already have. Well played today. Nice to meet you, Megan. Cadinho, looking for keys when we come back. Walt Disney Pictures presents Hercules. Now Hercules and all the stars are yours to keep with McDonald's Hero World Happy Meal. There are six out-of-this-world characters to collect. Plus you get a cheeseburger, fries and Coke, all for an earth-shattering $3. Uh-oh, here we go again. Hero World Happy Meal, now playing at McDonald's. Junior golfers, are you under 18 and would like the chance to play at a golf tournament this school holidays? Then enter the West Australian Channel 7 Junior Golf Classic. It's on Monday the 6th of October at Morangaroo Golf Course. There are events for boys and girls of all ages and great prizes to be won. So start practicing now and look for your entry form in the West Australian or phone Morangaroo Golf Course on 9484 1000 for details. Cocoa Pops Crunchies, a vase of nutritious puffed rice, with that mouth-watering chocolatey taste. It's the most awesome chocolatey crunch you'll ever munch. New Kellogg's Cocoa Pops Crunchies, seriously Cocoa Popular. Megan was 
pirouetting all over the place. Thank you very much for that, Megan. But you know what? You joined us just in time to find out which is the bonus key for everyone at home. That's the one it is today. There's the bonus key. That's that's the number. That's where it is. And it gets you these if it's found. Get a handle on that bonus key and you will put the Game Boys in your pockets completely self-contained. And Nintendo Game Boy will put more fun in your pants and this one comes with Mole Mania. Pocket size fun with Game Boy. James, where do you play with yours? At the footy. At the footy. James, you score to be high. Not a major. The umpire's not even one flag. You lost. Okay. Key run time. Two keys will put you in front. You're starting. Cara, to your starting position, please. To the standby position, please. Lee, two minutes on the clock. Count it down. Uh, I'm going to kick a goal one day. I know I will. I know I will. I've just got to figure out where I play with my Game Boy. That is obviously a correct answer. I'll get there. And so will Cara and Lee. Cara will get to the end of this half of the maze. And she will send Lee into the other half. She can bring out as many keys as she finds. But remember, Virginia need two keys to take the lead. If they find two keys, they will be 61 points in front. They really want to do that. Yesterday they had a key run and found no keys, unfortunately. They've got one! They've got one, so this is good. So far, so good. A third of the time gone, so we're looking at hopefully three keys, maybe more. Let's see, 75 left on the clock now. Kara in the desert. She'll be going up onto the jungle wall now. Up to the monkeys up there. So press their buttons. And maybe something for her. Yes, a second one! And so she's got two keys. That means Kadinya have now taken the lead. Kadinya, right this very second, 61 points in front. So this is good news for Kadinya. They have finally turned it around. Can they extend the lead? Yeah. <laughs> a bit of a wrestle there with Lucy. She's a bit of a tease, that little rat. She's a dirty rat. 25 seconds left on the clock now. Lee up at the castle. Looking for another couple of keys here. He's got one with him. That makes three in total. 15 seconds left. Can he find another one in the last 10 seconds? He moves around the turret. He goes down the fireman's pole. He says, good day to Boris. And the siren goes, Aruga. Come on out, Lee. He's on his way. Cara, very nicely done. Kadinya, good news for you guys. You've taken the lead. I've got two keys here. Quickly. Quickly. <laughs> ah, key number four, key number five, key number seven, the bonus key today. Ah, it's key number seven! <laughs> Step over this way, guys. Over this way. Okay. Three keys, 300 points. Add that to the scoreboard. This is the scores right now. 1,077 plays, 916. A lead of 161. Very well done today. Tomorrow, we'll be back with more amazing. Make sure you're with us. See ya. Head on in. Australia, James West, Hound Dog Clothing, Guys and Girls Threads for a funky generation, Perth, Molly and Rockingham, and most capital cities around Oz, and the big leaders in fashion footwear are on James's feet, Venom from Windsor Smith, all players and audience munch and crunch on date on muesli bars, and in